Marines from the Sever military group successfully drove Ukrainian forces out of the Kursk region. In this operation, they destroyed enemy combat vehicles and troops, forcing them to retreat from villages in the area. Before capturing the villages, the Marines conducted thorough reconnaissance to identify the positions of the Ukrainian armed forces. The use of drones for continuous surveillance enabled the Russian forces to establish a foothold in the area without losing ground. The assault was further strengthened by the firepower of BMP-3 vehicles, artillery support, and Cornet anti-tank missile systems, delivering significant destructive capability against enemy defenses. The success of this attack was also driven by the drone's ability to identify enemy movements in real time, allowing Russian forces to quickly seize strategic defense points. In addition to securing the area, the Russian Marines successfully confiscated Western-made military equipment used by Ukraine, as well as capturing several flags and personal items belonging to Ukrainian fighters. Although Ukrainian forces mounted a fierce resistance, they were unable to launch effective counterattacks. The bombardment from BMP-3 vehicles, effective artillery support, and precision strikes from the Cornet missile systems destroyed much of the enemy's defenses. This operation exemplified the effectiveness of Russian military tactics, which combined battlefield combat capabilities with advanced surveillance technology to achieve decisive victories. On another front, artillery units operating the 152mm self-propelled howitzer 2S3 Akasiya from the center group successfully conducted a coordinated strike that destroyed an enemy stronghold in the Avdivka direction. Their primary target was a concealed weapon system ready for use by the Ukrainian armed forces. In this operation, the troops not only eliminated enemy hardware, but also inflicted significant damage on logistical resources by destroying an ammunition depot that detonated due to a precise artillery projectile strike. The firing process was carried out under strict supervision by reconnaissance teams utilizing drones, ensuring the accuracy of the strikes. The success of this operation reflects the effectiveness of combat tactics that integrate artillery capabilities and aerial intelligence to achieve maximum results in battle. In a training field, commanders and Russian heroes led combat training to enhance soldiers' skills on the front lines. In the assault battalion of the motorized rifle formation from the Central Group, Major Mikhail Petlin, known as Saka, and Major Igor Zakharov, referred to as poetry, guided their troops. Attention was paid to commands communicated silently to enhance the element of surprise. They practiced using mock enemy trenches, as well as light weapons and grenades in challenging combined battle scenarios. Meanwhile, troops from the Central Group trained with the Terminator tank support fighting vehicles in the rear of the operation area before being deployed to the front lines. 
In this training, they shared combat experiences, developed new tactics, and practiced high-speed driving and direct fire. The Terminator tank support fighting vehicle is designed to provide fire support, equipped with two 30mm 2A42 guns, a heavy machine gun PKTM, in 7.62 mm caliber, four laser-guided anti-tank missiles, and two AGS-17 automatic grenade launchers. With the ability to engage multiple targets simultaneously, this system provides an advantage in combat support. During the exercises, the armed forces collaborated with the Central Military District formations to train the strategic rocket forces in air defense against modern weaponry. Various types of UAV, including the Alaran drones, were employed to detect mock sabotage groups. The primary goal of this training was to assess cooperation among military command and control, the skills of personnel managing rocket units, and to ensure readiness and effective responses to potential future challenges. The operations conducted by Russian forces demonstrate a strong synergy between combat tactics, advanced technology, and intensive training. The success in capturing territory and destroying enemy positions underscores the importance of integrated strategies, as well as the ability to adapt to the dynamics of modern warfare. This is not just about military strength, but also about the effectiveness of technological use and ongoing training to achieve strategic objectives on the battlefield. As always, thank you for watching and exploring the extraordinary stories from the world of military operations, strategic maneuvers, and cutting-edge technology. We hope this insight has provided you with a deeper understanding and appreciation of the complexity and advancements in military strategy and technology.